Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, I have a Dollarama haul for you guys today. I had to look to see which one I was on. Um, I have just a few things. I mean, uh, I have several things that have quite a bit of numbers to it, but overall it's just, it's not too big of a haul. Um, so the first thing I got, I did get some more of these Marvel blind bags, but when I was at the store, I noticed that they have different numbers on the back. So I don't know if that means they're different inside. Um, some of them are a little hard to tell if they're different just because like the Spider-Mans are a little bit hard to tell which one's which and Iron Man is kind of hard to tell apart from the Spider-Man. So I'm hoping that the different numbers mean the different ones because they had six different numbers and there's six figures. So I'm hoping that's what it means. Um, so I did end up grabbing one of each number and then I grabbed a couple of extras um, because I'm going to end up putting these in both stockings for the boys so that they can each have a set. Hopefully they'll each get a full set. Uh, so. We will see how that works out. Um, there's another one. There's another one. So, yeah, we'll see how it works out. I got a bunch of these. They're the Nightmare Before Christmas uh, blind bags. It says there's eight to collect. So you've got these eight right here. So I'm hoping I get a variety. I'm hoping they're not all repeats. I don't know. I don't see like any number on here. There's no nu number, I don't think. No, it's, it looks like they have the same, same numbers on it. Yeah, so there's no way to tell them apart, but I'm hoping I get a variety. I did get quite a few of these. I'm not going to lie. I did get quite a few. Um, <laughs> they're still coming. I got 10. I got 10 of them. That was all that was in the box, so I just grabbed all 10. Hopefully, I will get a variety and not a ton of repeats. But if I do get repeats, I can give them to my kids or give them out. I know Krista was collecting them, so, you know, if I get some that she didn't have, you know, just pass them along, basically. Uh, I did get some more of the... Oh, and these were two dollars and these were 350 so yeah i got more of the bells i got two more packs there's 16 in here for three dollars each i um like to hang them on the doors so that's kind of what they get used for that's pretty much all they get used for but I really like the silver and the white color combination so that's why I got these they do have uh, they have a green and red one they have an all silver one but I liked the uh, silver and the white so I got those I got some more stickers <laughs> I got this ornament set of gold. I got the blue snowflakes, the green stockings, 
the silver snowflakes, the red ornaments, and the red stockings. I thought these were super cute. They were $1.25 each, and yeah, they are the, um, they're kind of like the foam stickers, I think. I think that's what they are. It doesn't really say, but yeah, I think they're foam, and they're quite um, dimensional as far as, you know, they're, they're, they're raised up pretty high, so it would be good for uh, dimension on a card or pocket letter, anything like that. So I just really liked those. I grabbed four, four of these Hot Wheel cars. These are also for stocking stuffers. Um, you know, just my one son, he loves cars, anything car related he absolutely loves and these were I think a dollar 25 or a dollar 50 I'm not I don't remember exactly but so I got him four of these um yeah he he goes nuts for cars so I got I got more of the shampoo the uh, Garnier Ultimate Blends Shampoo, Delicate Oat. Um, it doesn't, like it doesn't make my head itch or burn or anything like that. So it is very gentle on my head. I'm not gonna say it's gonna be gentle on everyone's head, but it doesn't bother me. Whether or not it works, you know, I haven't used it long enough yet to determine that. So I figured I would pick up a few more just in case and, you know, kind of give it a while to see if it actually works. And these are $4 each. Um, you know, if it works, I'm happy to get them there and pay the, the, that price. Uh, I'm just hoping it does end up working because I'm done with my head causing all kinds of problems, <laughs> so, yeah. Okay, oh, here's some more of those bags. I'm trying to get like-minded things out of here. Okay, so let's see if I can put this somewhere. Okay, I got a bunch of socks. Um, I got myself a couple pairs of the Thermal Crew socks. They're $2 each. Shoe size is 4 to 10, so that'll fit me no problem. But they just feel really nice. I was touching them in the store, and they just felt really nice. So I wanted to go ahead and try these. And I got two pairs just in case I liked them. Um... I don't know. They 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 feel pretty good though. So and it says they've got the uh, stay up rib legs, so that you won't your it won't not that it won't fall down, but it's less likely to fall down in your boot. So that is always good. I, oh my socks always fall down in inside my boots. Drives me crazy. So I got these two pairs. And I want to say, no, no, okay, I got this one pair for my husband. It's a size 7 to 11, and it's $1.50. Um, it's honestly, I don't expect him to really wear these very often. It's more, you know, I just, I like to buy him stuff as kind of like a gag gift type thing. Um got him one I think with reindeers on it one year it, it's just you know a fun little thing and if he wants to wear it to like his Christmas party or something like that for work you know he has something a little festive to wear so yeah and then I found these crew socks again for me uh, there's two pairs in each size 4 to 10 and they're $1.50 and I just really liked the look of them Honestly, I mean, they're my my colors. 
So, and they're, they're thin. They're not thick socks or anything like that. So that's kind of like what I like. I don't, I don't usually go for the thick socks. Those thermal socks that I got, those are the first time I've ever had like really thick socks. Um, but I, I usually prefer the thinner ones. So I went ahead, I needed some more. You know, your socks get old, they get worn. So I just needed to replace some more of my socks. I got, if I can get them out. Um, there's one more. Yep. Okay. These are adhesive sequin tape. Oh, I thought that was really interesting. Um, it was the first time I had seen it in my store. So I wanted to go ahead and grab one of each color. And it says there's one meter on each roll. And you can see if it will focus. You can see what it looks like. It's got a backing on it. So you just, but I thought it was really interesting. I don't know. I mean, it feels like there could be fallout from this, but it's not coming off with me just kind of like rubbing my hand on it because it's not glitter. It's sequins. That's what it says anyway. But yeah, so I got a purple. I got a pink. I got this peach color, coral. And then I got a blue and I got a silver and that's all they had at my store. So yeah, I just grabbed one of each. Now this one, I don't know. They, they yeah, they, they're all zip tied. So this one's a little smushed, but it should still work. I grabbed some more of the pepperettes on the go these things oh my god I just love these things it's like pepperoni sticks basically and they're two dollars each but yeah uh, it's an impulse buy at the end these are usually um, right near the registers or uh, near the uh, Pepsi machine that they you, the the refrigerator that they have there for the Pepsis and stuff it's kind of like right by that <laughs> it's kind of like an impulse buy at the end of, of my weight or my shopping as I'm waiting to check out type of thing. I got some more, some more tags. I can't help myself. I don't, I don't know what it is. These have nine pieces and they're $1.25, but I thought if I didn't want to use them as the tags, I could always pop the piece off and use it on a Christmas, uh, Christmas card or something, Christmas tag, like a, a, you know, one of those bigger tags, or even like if I do a Christmas pocket letter, I could use these on that instead. So I went ahead and grabbed it. Couldn't help myself. Something I had not seen before. They're called crushed shells. Now they're not, it's more like broken shells because they're not crushed, but there's 150 grams for $1.25. And they had a bunch of different types in there, but I grabbed these because it's got like all this purple coloring in it. And, and then I grabbed the pink one. I thought these were really interesting they work great in fairy gardens. They're just really pretty. So I had to grab these two. I couldn't leave without them. And then the last thing I got were these notebooks. Um, I have people in mind for these, so but uh, I got a pink one. I got two of the blue, well, like, kind of like teal blue. 
I got a red and then I got a blue. Now these are all like metallic-y looking and everything like that. This one's just blue. Um, but they do all, I'll show you this one. It's called Victoria's Journals. They are $4 a piece. They are a purse journal and I'm assuming these are a Dollarama brand because the, um, that's not a sticker on there. That's actually part of the label. And then you've got a bookmark in each one with a little charm on it. So I thought they were super cute. They're just lined, they're just lined paper inside, but they were adorable and I loved how it had the, now the one doesn't have it, but the others had like the little foiling on the edge. So I just thought that was really neat. You can see all the different colors there. But yeah, so I thought they were cute. And like I said, I have people in mind for these. So these are already spoken for. But if you are at your Dollarama, yeah, they, they feel, oh, they feel so nice. The covers feel amazing. So yeah, I would go and look for these. I thought they were super nice feeling. They're very flexible. They're not stiff at all. So yeah. Anyway, that was it for my haul. Uh, like I said, it wasn't too horribly big, just like a lot of each item. But uh, yeah, so that was it. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you all in my next one. Bye.